morning and welcome to channel 48 for those that still have uh, problems installing the GSI image uh, that I installed on my Mido and that actually works kind of good uh, I'm still gonna make a little video for you because I don't want you, uh, I don't want you to break your phone you know and I know that many of you want to try Android 12 uh, don't do this if this is your only phone because the phone part is not working yet you cannot make phone calls um, you can as well not make uh, pictures and videos even though uh, there is a camera built in um, but hey who knows open camera might fix the problem or some other camera you know g cam name it and if not then we will have to wait but then still we played with android 12 in a very early stage on a device that has nothing to do with google because this is not a google pixel phone okay because these uh, um, android developers preview builds came out only for those phones but thanks to amazing people you know that create uh, a gsi uh, images or create uh, some port you know we have in a very early stage uh, for instance on the redmi note 7 uh, and now as well on the mido android 12 running okay maybe it's not you know the very best yet but hey it's only the second uh, build from google so many things must be still fixed but how nice is it if you cannot be there already in a very early stage at least i feel amazingly good and uh, <laughs> i even added the account to my redmi uh, 7 it's just one amazing android 12 phone now and i love it yeah i just i just love it so you know i as well want to bring android 12 to my other redmi phones such as my mido and my redmi 7a and i'm working on the redmi 7a at this point and uh, i'm gonna finish it after we did this video i'm gonna put it to charge as well a bit although we need this cable because we're gonna go into a recovery mode mm -hmm. okay so what you should know is that uh, you should install orange fox recovery there is an orange fox recovery uh, for the mido available find it uh, online just google it and you will find it so i'm gonna for this video kill my system that is running very nice and you know for you to understand and learn how to do this i will you know make uh, this exception and kill this beautiful device so i can learn even more about it all right, are you ready to go? Let's get started. Welcome to channel 48. Okay, though. So there is the file. It's already uploaded. I will share the link uh, later. Okay. And here we are with the middle. For the disbelievers, uh, I'm going to show you about the device. Here you can see it. Android version is S. See that? Okay, so this thing is a nice little tablet at this moment. Restart. Because sound, Wi-Fi, things like that work fine. With mm -hmm. volume up and the power during a reboot. Whenever you see the me, you let go of the power and then you let go of the, of the volume up. You will get into a recovery mode. I'm using Orange Fox uh, because, yeah, it's just a good recovery. Mm -hmm. I just love it. It's, it's very, very, very handy. Okay, so let's go home and let me first show you what you should do. Okay, you should go here to that little wheel here. And then you're going to go to OTA and RUM. All right. And you're going to turn on Disable Force Encryption. And disable DM Verity. I could not find that one. These two will be turned off. You must turn them on. Okay, if you want to do this, you must turn this on. And then you don't have to download no disable DM Ver Ver Verity uh, file and, and these things. It's totally not needed. Okay, it's just not needed. All right, so um, now we're going to go back. And what we can do is, um, let me think let me think let me think if we're gonna do a complete wipe 
we could wipe system okay there's another thing that you need to know um before you're gonna install this um it would be nice if you were for instance on uh, lineage os 18.1 um because that will as well give you an updated uh, fender okay that is that is one of the i think that is the first thing that you must do you must first install lineage os 18 and make sure that you know it's booted up and, and everything is okay and then you go back to uh to into the recovery and then you can uh, format data okay you can as well um just do a wipe data catch uh wipe so we're wiping the system now okay and then we're gonna go back and reboot back into recovery it will say no os installed are you sure yes <clears throat> and um big chance that this gsi will as well work on other redmi devices so if you have uh, a 64 uh, bit phone and a 64 bit uh, recovery you can as well try this okay so as you can see uh, my files are still here and um, I as well try to install uh, the Airfan uh, GSI. It uh, it booted up, but it was giving many errors, and uh, the drive was not uh, was not uh, available. Okay, at least I I could not do anything. So you're gonna go for uh, I renamed the file. Uh, the 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 GSI that you unpacked it's gonna be a zip file you must unpack it you, then you're gonna have an image file and that image file you must copy to the internal of your phone okay this here is an image file you see system image so I renamed it I called it uh, Android S uh, USP uh, Formido okay so you select the system and you're gonna select system image you see that and then you're gonna swipe and then it's gonna install I'm doing this on the R11 uh, release from Orange Fox okay so this is in fact the latest this one is Android 11 compatible I think it as well works for Android 12 okay that's kind of nice to know, toch? Okie do. We're almost there. Boom. And now the system is installed. And now you can just hit reboot. Yeah, it will say no OS installed. Are you sure? Yes, mm -hmm. I'm sure. And then it's gonna go to the me and when you're gonna hear to do doom it will start booting listen to the computer yeah and now it's gonna boot see so now we're booting android 12 android s it's gonna boot really fast it's not slow charging is working everything is working i did not test the gps yet but hey you guys can as well go and test a little bit though i don't have to do everything and there you go there you go we already installed it and it's a very minimal this is aosp by asp master yeah aosp master peeps there you go android s you see that Yeah, you can see it. Google Play System Update S. Security patch February 2021. So how to get started? So now you have Android 12 running on your Mido. But hey, no Google Play Store. So you're going to come and ask me. Gaps. Well, <laughs> there is no GAPS 12 package yet, so uh, I think uh, we will have to do that in an alternative way, okay? So uh, let me show you how to do that. Um, 
you will need to, I think, yeah, there's no browser or so, you know. So what you should do is is go to to your computer and just get some files. And here I have all my files. You know, you can as well get a store. Let me see where is the Aurora store. Aurora 3. I should have 4 as well. This one. Continue. Oh no, this is Aurora Droid. I don't want that. I think it's this one. Open. But I'm not connected to the internet yet. So I should connect to the internet. Uh, about, uh, yeah, I know some of you want to know about gestures. They are, they are there. I saw them. Gestures. Gestures. Three bottom. There. Gesture navigation. Dang. But it doesn't work too good because this thing has, in fact, physical bottoms. So, yeah, it works, but not so good. So, just use these buttons, okay? Um, yeah, so, I'm going to leave it up to you. Uh, what you want to do and how you want to use the system. Uh, deny. You see, the camera quits. Uh, phones. I'm showing you what is not working now. It's going to quit and it's going to reboot. You see, so these two things you should not do. You can as well remove these icons from the desktop so you don't see them. Uh, you see that peeps so that is it man yeah i'm not gonna make this video any second longer uh you can go ahead and play with it i already made a live video i went to the middle room to tell the guys about it but uh i had no pictures to show it yet i i you know i just woke up i was very happy after testing for more than 12 hours that the system did not reboot or do crazy things, you know. So I went to the room to let them know, but then I almost got myself banned because, yeah, they were thinking that I was making some joke and I don't know why these guys are like this. Probably maybe some other people are doing these things, but I would never do a thing like that, you know. But then again, that says more something about them than about me. Because I told them that I would immediately go and upload a video about it, but then they were like, they thought that I would, uh, that I would uh, advertise my channel. I don't have to advertise my channels, guys. YouTube is doing that for me, Google. Google is advertising my channel, not me. I don't go to other rooms, hey, come and watch my videos. You don't have to watch my videos, man. I already have people watching my videos. You know, I'm not looking for viewers. I'm not looking for nothing. I'm only looking for knowledge. That's the only thing that inter interests me, knowledge. You know? Money is, is not even of importance to me. When I do something, I never do it for the money. I do it because I like doing it and, and I feel good doing it. You understand? So that's it, enough said, back to the studio. Okay, that was it my friends, at least something for you to play with uh, for this Sunday. If you have another device that is as well, you know, a 64-bit uh, device, and you have a 64-bit Orange Fox running onto it, with, with, with uh, how do you say that, with, um, with treble, if you have a treble device, then you can as well try it. My next goal will be the S8 and the S9, so who knows what's gonna happen, maybe soon you're gonna see a video here. Android 12 for the Samsung Galaxy S8. With broken phone. <laughs> and no screen brightness. Who knows? So yeah, that's all uh, in the future peeps or in the coming future. So I want to thank you for watching. I want to thank USP Master for, uh, for his work, you know, big up. Um, 
yeah that's it so go and play with your phone i can go and set up mine uh, but first i'm going to continue with the work that i was doing on the pine the redmi 7a because i already had uh android 12 running uh well it booted uh, up to the up to the desktop but then i got a, a message saying that something is not good with i don't know what with the hardware blah blah so probably the fender must be updated maybe i should do the same trick install linux os 18 on it and then install maybe that will be updated fender i don't know so i will think about that one uh but for you uh go ahead and go see if you can as well get android 12 on uh, any of your phones out there that you have because it's really really amazing thanks again osp community google android everybody that made this possible thank you very much bye bye <laughs>